If I see another video claiming that hypochlorous acid is the best thing to use after a workout in place of cleanser, I am going to lose it. I think we do our clients and the general public a disservice when we oversimplify acne and are not clear on the limitations of a product such as hypochlorous acid. I love this product, love this brand. It's a great ingredient. It does have disinfecting properties, very effective at killing bacteria. Also a great wound healer. It is great for inflammation, acne, rosacea, psoriasis, eczema, for the inflammation behind these conditions. But we need to understand hypochlorous acid does not go after the retentive matter in the pore that is the start of the acne process. This is not removing the sticky skin cells that are the origin story of acne. If we address bacteria on the skin, it doesn't mean we are treating our acne. And this summer I have seen the blowback of people going to the gym, sweating, and using a product like this in place of a cleanser. When we do that, we delay actually cleansing our skin and using our true acne treatment products that we need to interrupt the acne process. So this is your sign not to use this as a lazy girl hack. Don't skip your cleanse. This is a great product. It can be an asset to your routine, but if you are acneic and using this in place of a cleanser, don't say I didn't warn you.